Good morning, my friends. So today is the 4th of October. I have a few new videos up, so if you haven't checked it, please let me know because I'm not too sure what's going on. Maybe it's just things that you guys don't want to watch. Maybe I'm doing the SEO incorrectly, or maybe I just freaking suck at YouTube, but a lot of the videos that I've been posting recently have not been getting the views that I expected them to. Maybe you guys just don't like plants, or maybe you guys don't like DIYs, but I highly, highly doubt that. And I don't know what's happening. This isn't me complaining at all, I promise. I don't want to complain anymore, but I'm just discouraged. You know what I mean? Like, so many people asked me to do Vlogtober. Uh, so many people told me to do vlogs all the time. So many people have been telling me to just make more videos and do more DIYs and do more this, this, and that. And then I do it, and then no one watches it, and no one comments on it, and it just makes me really discouraged. And it upsets me when people who have 20,000 views or whatever, like, complain about getting that much. You know what I mean? I mean, I guess it could be the same where someone who has like only three views say that I'm complaining too much when I get 500, but it's just different from what it used to be and I don't know why it's changing so quickly. I'm trying to do everything I can to, to bring it back and it just sucks because I feel like the only way I can get the views that I want is if I make this extremely personal, if I do more videos about my eye and it's like, that's not the only thing about me. <laughs> I'm a human who's trying to survive and what helps me survive is plants and food and connecting with you guys. So it, it is really discouraging and disheartening when some people complain about my videos and then when I do what they want, they don't even watch or comment it, you know? So I'm sitting down editing a video though. I really hope that you guys like the upcoming ones. You know, I have a vlog that I'm uploading today. Look at this beautiful yellow wall and my beautiful sky sky. Hi, mamas. Everyone loved you from the last video, huh, mamas? Oh. So I am babysitting her at her mom's place that she's subletting right now, so it's a little bit easier because I babysat her on Tuesday and it was a little bit difficult. Um, I don't have a playpen at my house, obviously, so. Yeah, but today I just have a feeling like it's gonna be so much better. Look at her, she's so calm, just chill in there. And this place is so beautiful. I'll do like a quick little tour. So there's this yellow wall with this Bob Marley painting, this amazing Polaroid camera. There's a baby that comes with it, oh mobs. This amazing Buddha, look at it. And then this crystal necklace, so gorgeous. Some salt lamps, an amazing Ganesha. Hi, moms. Oh, no, no, no. She knows how to dance now. Ring. Resting in my arms again. Yeah. Dance, 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 dance. <laughs> what are you... It's only 11.52. Today was a little bit difficult because when I got there, um, I was gonna stay at their house for a couple of hours and then I was gonna go home, but then Yesenia forgot the car seat. Yesenia's her mom, I love her. Um, but she forgot the car seat because normally we meet outside so we like bring everything from her car to my car so it's understandable, you know? And so I was chilling at her house, Skyla shit all over her. So. Skyla doesn't want to talk about it though. Skyla's embarrassed Tom moms. But yeah, she had a little accident today and I had to clean that up. So there was no way of me actually filming everything, you know? And I didn't think it was going to be appropriate, like showing the poop coming out of her diaper all the way up her back and into her hair. 
and I don't think you guys want to see that either so I wanted to think of you guys you know but now I think I'm either gonna go home or visit my mom at her work look at this little cushion playpen I made for her last time was she was here she bumped her little bitty heady oh yeah you did yeah you did so this time oh don't put that end in your mouth so this time we're gonna keep you in a very secure place but don't worry, if she's still able to go around, I'm gonna take her on a walk, and I'm gonna feed her. She's just like in a playpen, but it's just filled with cushiony stuff, huh, moms? Do you like it? She seems pretty content. I hope you guys can see her. Oh, hello, Mayor. Sorry, Mayor, but we're grounded. Woo! Yummy. Do you, do you not like it? She usually like shakes and is happy when she likes it. Oh no, you like so? Oh, you'd rather have the bottle though. You want this? Yummy, moms. Her mom didn't pack a bib, so I should use a towel, but. I think pretty neat with it. It just goes all over her face, but not her clothes. You know? Oh, just sweet. Because sometimes she goes. Oh, you like it, don't you, mom? Sweet potato. So little girl is super, super calm right now, huh, mamas? So I wanted to show you this quick little thing I changed up in my walkway. I'm pretty sure I already showed you guys my um, plant collection, but it has changed so much already since I did my last one, huh, Skyla? So I have so much stuff to show you. Well, I already showed you this, um, but... What's new here? This one is new. I have new propagations. I added more in here and then more propagations as well. And then right outside, I'll show you later though because I don't want Skylar to think I'm leaving, but that is a donkey's tail and I'm so excited. And in this guy, I have all more little guys propagating, so I'm super, super excited. <laughs> I think you like bite right if you told your friends about your condition. But I'd have zero chance in a normal life. The one girl she tells she stops talking to. What happened with you and Zoe? <gasps> Are we done for today? Guess who's here? Come on, we're gonna go say hi to her. Come on, we're gonna go say hi. Um, has final say. My Guess who's here? Do you remember her? Um, Do you remember? More details. You say yes, you can have whatever you want. Good morning, my beautiful zombies. So today is a new day. It's actually Friday. I know you guys don't really know what days my vlogs are. I haven't been really putting them up recently, but I just feel like it's better that way. Less editing, <laughs> you know? Yesterday, I babysat Skyla, but today I am going to go thrift store shopping just to find some pots very very quickly i'm not going to stay there too long and then i am going to edit some videos film some videos do a lot of work stuff before this weekend because i am going to have a very fun and eventful weekend tomorrow i'm going to brunch and then bingo and then sunday it's one of my friend's birthday parties so i'm excited to take you guys along with me so let's just get today started first thing is my outfit <laughs> This is how you know I'm from LA when I dress like this in fall Because it's still sunny and yeah So this shirt I actually got from my friend Nicole. She just um, Gave it to me to donate, but I just kept it these shorts. I believe I actually got at a thrift store, too I'm not too sure this Thrift store these shoes. I didn't though. These were sent to me Oh my camera is dying. Oh. Also, I just wanted to update you guys on my little plant situation. I'm not too sure if I showed it yesterday, but have a new little garden room. I changed my front place because no one was sitting there. That's why I had the bench so we can put on our shoes, but we didn't use it anyway. We would always just walk somewhere in here to put on our shoes. So 
Love that. Love, love, love. I added this vest. Is it too much? Oh well. Let's go. First thrift store that we are at is the Salvation Army Family Store in Pasadena, California. So here are some random stuff. Oh, this is kind of cool. I made a hole in it. I wonder how much this is. Two of them. This would be cool to propagate. Woo, let's get this air on, it is so hot. I shut you down. So I got a bunch of stuff at this Salvation Army. I wasn't looking for clothes, but if I did do clothes, then I would have gotten 50% off on anything that I purchased that was clothing. I'm just not in the mood to purchase clothes because I did just buy a lot of clothes, which I'll show you soon. Let's try to do another thrift store to see if we can find any more pots, and if not, we'll just go home and film this haul. All right, see ya. All right, and here is store number two. They used to have a location um, on Hill in Pasadena, but now they are on a different street. I don't know what it is. All the Dean Drive. I just looked behind me. This is a pretty good section here. I found this, which I love. Friends. So today is Saturday. I'm going with my friend Barbara to bingo, which is gonna be so funny. But before then, I somehow got my hands on this bad boy. <laughs> and I'm going to drill some holes into things. No, I'm just kidding. I am going to be drilling holes into my pots. The pots that I do have, it sucks because I potted this one, which I might have to take apart and then repot again, which I don't want to do because I don't want to traumatize it or anything, but it doesn't have a hole. So these are the three that I am going at to attempt to do today. And you guys are going to watch me and hopefully I don't fail. Okay, towel. And I am going to look on YouTube. The first video I find, um, I'll YouTube drill hole in pot. Okay. Ooh. All right. What year was this made? 2008? Oh, 2012. Today I'm sitting under my big gazebo with all my beautiful holes and pole in it. And it's most important to open this that you're spraying that drill bit with water. So you need a spray bottle. And how can you get it? Because it causes a lot of friction. I've laid my cloth down. Okay. And I'm going to put my pot down. So all I'm right. Hold it really still. Spray That's some pretty water still. on there first. And here we go. We're going to get started. First thing we're going to do is make a little niche. Okay. Can you see that? Yeah. Got a little niche started. That is the beginning. That's the first thing you do. You can see that I have the I'm kind of nervous. The stop, or it'll just kind of go right through, and you got to try to catch it so your drill doesn't. We went through. All right. So we've got a hole in our pot. Look how easy that was. What the fuck, bitch? Not bad. Looks good here. All right, we're done with that part. All right, we finished our project. Here we are with our hole in the bottom of our pot. It's like really bad though. This is really taking forever. I'm gonna try to find another one. Then ease up on the pressure as the bit makes its way through the pop. Use a consistent medium speed to avoid using a high speed and spinning the bit too fast. With your 
Nothing is happening. Okay, let's try something else. Let's try this guy. So another thing we like to do with ceramic bases is turn them into shades for some cool modern lamps that we're building. You can do this easily. Screw the piece onto the inside. You can have this lamp kit for $5 at Ikea. Once it's tight, you can... Are you fucking with me right now? This is the most annoying thing in the world. I don't want to do this anymore. I give up. I refuse. No more. No holes. Never mind, guys. I failed. Beautiful lighting, beautiful barb. Look who's with me. We're going to bingo. Oh, what? Oh, what? Oh, what? <laughs> oh my god, that's great. <laughs> We're at bingo and I just tripped. Yeah. Oh my gosh, this is beautiful. Barbara oh, is like. Seven, eight, one, two, three, 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 Take a picture with it. I mean, yeah, take a picture with it. Yes. Yo, mama.